Hello everyone, my name is Vipul Jain and in this video I am going to tell you about a new experience which has been introduced in Power Apps Canvas App Studio. So you can see that I am in Power Apps Studio and here today I am going to show you the variable and collection viewer which has been introduced very recently by Microsoft in Power Apps. So I'll give you the scenario. Generally, what, what, what happens is that when we create an app, it grows, it becomes big, and we create multiple types of variable, be it global variable, contextual variables, component variables, and at the same time, we create multiple collections. So earlier, the issue was that we were not able to identify that what the variable has been created, what is the definition of that variable, and what is its direct use, or maybe where that particular variable or collection has been used in my power apps altogether. I want to see that screen probably or maybe in the multiple screens where it has been used. So considering this fact and considering this issue or scenario, maybe Microsoft has introduced now a new variable and collection viewer where you can see all the variables and collections in one place. You can definitely see the global variable, contextual variables, component variables, and the collection. So that's what I'm going to show you in this video. I am pretty sure that this information is really going to help you because this is very new. But one uh, simple thing, a setting, if you don't see this particular option on the left hand side, on the left navigation in your Power Apps, the chances are high that you are not using the latest or the recommended version of the power app so what you can do is you can go to just settings go to the settings a pop-up will open all right and you can go to the support and you can see the authoring version here just click on add it and from this drop down definitely you can change the authoring version you can go with the latest one or the recommended one both are okay if you are not able to see this option in your power app studio so I am into a sample app. This app, I, in this app, I have multiple screens. I have created multiple variables and collections. That's why I have taken this particular sample app. For this video, what I'm going to show is the variable and the collection viewer. So I have clicked on the variable and collection viewer. And as I clicked on it, you can see it is differentiating between the global variable, context variables, component variables, and the collection. And it is giving you the definition of that particular variable also what are global variables which are defined across the app globally contextual variables which are defined for a particular screen and can only be referenced by that screen only component component variables and the collection so we are going to see that how we can identify this now so if i click on the global variables you see it is showing me that i have created only one global variables in this particular app which is the var display name so where display name this is the name of the variable you can see it is showing me the definition where it has been used how cool and pretty it is now i can identify my variable where it has been used and if i click on this it's again very interesting to see that it is showing me the location as well where i have created this particular variable so i really like this particular feature and the users also it is showing me the direct use where this particular variable has been used so you can see that it has been used here at the same time if you want to see the text with which it currently holding this particular variable is currently holding so in this particular pop-up it is showing you all the global variables which has been used and the contextual variables you see here that i have used this contextual variables where number it's currently holding the value is 18 and similarly for collections so collections you can see it is showing me three collections and in this particular app believe me only three collections are uh, created for now user info when i click on this user info you can see it is showing me all the values which this collection is currently holding up user info test data you can see all the data which is uh, holded by this particular collection and collection of customer so uh, in this way you can definitely see the uh, location of this particular collection where it has been used this particular collection it has been used uh, test data collection collection of customer and for the contextual variables global variables now this is uh, the collection and i will say variable viewer which has been introduced in power apps and this is definitely going to help us as the app makers to identify where the particular variable and collection has been used and what is its definition 
so that's the purpose of creating this video to let you know about this new feature of variable and collection viewer thank you